All right, so here's a look at the uh, Warren 9.5 CTI. You got the actual Warren winch right here. It's a 9,500 pound. Um, I believe it's a hundred and what was it like 20 or 25 feet of cable. But you got your uh, free spool and engage right here. Just turn that. Um, got your uh, plug in for your mount right here. Nice black color, match my truck pretty good. Then you got your uh, Haas fair lead right here. Your uh, motor right there. Oh, it's 5 sixteenths, that's what it is. The rope, aircraft wire rope, 5 sixteenths. Never exceed this load. Sure. Then you got your uh, handy portable mount right here. Just goes into your uh, square hitch receiver. If you have one on the front of your truck and the back of the truck. Um, cable, cable. Your uh, remote, your battery. Terminals basically to uh, run underneath your truck and hook up to the battery and whatnot. And then all your your hook and your pen for mounting it into your square hitch receiver and your connectors for everything. So yeah, that's about it. I just gotta get it mounted up and installed in the bracket here. Then I'll go put it on the truck and let you guys see what it looks like if it's not dark out. All right, so there the uh, Warren 9.5 CTI is all mounted up in the multi-mount harness. It's uh, roughly 120 pounds, so fairly heavy. Yeah, so to move it around, just lift it up by the handles here. And away you go. I got the uh, neoprene cover for it too over here. So I'll throw that on quick and see how that looks on it. Then I'll go uh, put it in the truck to see what it looks like in the truck. It's dark out now, so I'll probably just take a couple photos and upload it at the end of this video. All right, and there is the uh, worn neoprene winch cover for it. We've got the little uh, kind of half leather embroidered worn logo on there. Only thing I noticed when you uh, put this on, you kind of want to pull it off to the side like this and then slide it down underneath here on the corners. Same with this one over here. You basically want to pull it off to the side and then just slide it down underneath there. And then it should keep it uh, dry from all the elements and everything if you're going to leave it on your vehicle. So let's look at the uh, worn neoprene winch cover. There's the back. Uh, this one here that fits the 9.5 TI or CTI, whatever is. Uh, Model number 81761. Oh, yeah, there you go. All right, well, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you guys around.